Year on year, Oris always seemed to release vastly appealing watches to their reliable, dedicated audience. Fortunately, this year has been no different. Let's take a look at the new models in the Oris lineup for 2019. The Oris Aquis Date Relief. As you can probably guess, the watch has been inspired by water. The grey dial recalls colours of a stormy sea, with the bezel acting as a reminder of the texture of water. For me, the one to go for here is the red rubber strap option. The bracelet, grey leather and grey rubber add more emphasis to the red seconds hand. However, the red strap really makes the watch pop on the wrist. Next up, the Oris Great Barrier Reef Limited Edition 3. This model looks to stick with the theme of preserving the bodies of water in our world. It's been created in close partnership with the Reef Restoration Foundation. Since releasing previous Great Barrier Reef models, the issue has only gotten worse, something both companies involved seem to feel pretty serious about. Moving away from the great cause behind this watch, the design of this model is easily one of my favourite. The dial is a gradient blue colour which gets lighter towards the middle. The bezel is a dark blue tone. The triangle at 12 and the date function all have been finished in a yellow slash orange colour. On the wrist, the watch and the colours feel great. I can only imagine how cool this would look in bright sunshine. The Oris Aquis Date GMT. This is something which has been lacking from the Oris lineup, so I'm glad they spent the time to release it correctly. Oris have gone for a shortened GMT hand, tipped in orange on a centralised track. Once again, this model comes in at 43.5mm, which Oris actually confirmed is their most popular size. In person, this watch has a great, practical, do anything, go anywhere feel to it. The dashes of light orange on the dial and GMT hand add nice final touches to its sportiness. Strap wise, there is a bracelet, leather, and rubber option to go for. For me, the bracelet wins this one. The Oris Aquis Date Fresh Waters. Here we have a new 39.5mm Aquis Date in brand new colours and tones. This is a smaller diving watch that goes for a mint slash grey gradient look. The overall look of this watch is more of a pastel shade, meaning it does feel a little more feminine when compared to others in the range. However, saying that, the watch feels very unique and fun on the wrist. In my mind, there is no doubt this is a unisex watch, and can be enjoyed by all manner of wrists. Moving away from the Aquis now, and we have the latest 65 range updates. For me, there are three standout additions here. First up, a new green dial, which much like we found out about in our 10 for 10 series, complements bronze insanely well. This watch only emphasises this more by combining the bronze edge bezel, cream coloured loom, gold coloured indices and hands. The other new colour we were shown was the new black dial version. This keeps the same bronze edge bezel and gold colouring dial details much like the green option. This model here is a 42mm edition, which is complete with a dome sapphire crystal to really make the watch's old school style pop. The Oris 65 in bronze two-tone. Oris now address the 40mm 65 divers and release a steel and bronze version with a curved blue dial. This watch has such a classy, appealing look to it. A 40mm, it's very wearable for a range of wrist sizes, which is a good thing, as I think we'll see this watch out in the wild quite a lot. The combo on the rivet bracelet, all bronze coloured bezel and a great price point, it's hard to argue that this is one of the best hits of Buzzword 2019. Now let's start to wrap up the Oris releases and take a look at the pointer date. We've already learnt about the pointer date 80th anniversary in our 10 for 10 series, so let's jump straight into the 2019 models. Oris continue with the theme of two-tone bronze models with the addition of this, the big crown pointer date in two-tone with a deep blue dial. This model was actually available with two different strap options, however both are very similar. I'm used to the 40mm pointer date, yet I found it refreshing to wear a smaller edition of the watch. To me, this model feels a lot more faithful to the original point of date we have seen over the years. Finally for the point of date, we have an absolute gem. A glossy red dial point of date with either leather strap or bracelet option. There isn't really too much to say about this one, just look at it. The deep red dial really makes this watch look classy. And unsurprisingly, on the wrist, it feels just right. There was one more release we got some hands-on time with at Baselworld 2019. This Pro Pilot Timer GMT does come in at 44mm wide, however the large matte black dial with highly legible indices and hands means the watch feels very purposeful on the wrist. The stainless steel bezel also adds a nice sporty vibe to the watch, adding further emphasis to the red GMT hand. 
If you've got a larger wrist and you're in the market for a GMT, you can't go wrong with either the new Aquis GMT or this Pro Pilot whatsoever. To find out more about the latest Oris releases, check out the link in our description, as well as further thoughts on other releases on the WatchGecko online magazine.